talking about battery jump starters. There are different types of battery jump starters. Uh, some you have to plug into a 120 volt wall outlet to provide power and then they have the two alligator clamps you would hook up to your dead battery. Other models like the one we're reviewing today um, you don't need to plug into a wall outlet. It has a built-in 12 volt battery inside of it so that's nice because you can store it in your trunk in the back of your truck uh, so if you're at a remote job site, remote location, and your battery's dead, you can jump start your car. Today we're talking about the Everstart 750 peak amp jump starter power station and air compressor. That, that's a model uh, JUS750CE. Here are the features specifications of this jump starter. Again, 750 peak amp jump starter with power station, two USB charge ports. It's got a built-in heavy-duty booster cables with power coated, uh, excuse me, powder coated metal alligator clamps. Um, so you can jump start your, your motorcycles, ATVs, cars, small vans, small pickup trucks. Uh, it's not going to jump start a semi truck or a bus or an RV. Um, it has a built-in air compressor up to 120 PSI max and it has an adjustable uh, LCD screen where you can adjust the pressure that you want and it will automatically shut off at the set pressure. Um, that LCD screen provides real-time information like the voltage, the pressure, uh, if there's a fault, and the jumper battery status. If it's low, it needs to be recharged. This unit also has a built-in LED work light. So if it's dark outside, you can turn that on and see what you're doing. Um, it has a built-in audible reverse polarity alarm. So if you accidentally hook up the alligator clamps to the wrong terminals on your battery, it's gonna let you know. It also has a safety feature where you can't accidentally overcharge the internal battery. It'll shut itself off once it reaches its maximum charge. Uh, it has a nice, comfortable, non-slip grip carry handle. Weighs 10 pounds. Uh, it's roughly 11 inches by around 5 and 3 quarter inches by 12 and a half inches. It also comes with an owner's manual, one-year warranty. Again, this is not a paid uh, promotion for Everstart. Just want to make that clear. So today I'm doing a quick review of this battery jump starter slash air compressor that I recently acquired. Uh, this is an Everstart Max model number JUS750CE. So I'm currently charging it up right now. So it's telling me what the status is of the internal battery. It has a 12 volt internal battery. So if you need to jumpstart your car, you can carry this around in your trunk. And if you're in a remote location, it'll jumpstart it for you. And so you again, to, to charge it, you just hook it up to a standard 120 volt outlet. It does not come with a power cord to charge this. So you have to use an extension cord And again, this it has an air compressor function up to 120 PSI. That's stored back here. maybe a two foot long hose. Then it's got your positive and your black negative alligator clamps. So this will go on the negative terminal of your battery on your car. The red one, the positive goes on the positive terminal. And again, they're not very long. These are about maybe 15 inches, 18 inches.
and it has a work light on the front of it. It also has two USB charging ports. You can adjust the air pressure up or down with the positive and negative buttons. And then to jump start it, you'd hook up your alligator clamps to your dead battery and then turn this knob to the on position and try to start your car. And it also has a, a non-slip carrying handle. And then here's some of the specs. You see 12 volt, 375 amp, instantaneous. Your USB output is five volts at 2.1 amps maximum. Air pressure 120 PSI max. And this is almost done charging. I haven't actually got to try it out yet. It also comes with an air needle, so if you need to blow up a basketball or football or something like that, you could do that. And a quick start guide. Anyways, that's it for this video. Thanks. And here's a few more images of this jump starter. You're getting to see the USB uh, outlets there. Charge your cell phone, your laptop, whatnot. Thanks for watching. Please like, share, subscribe, leave me a comment for future video topics you'd like me to cover.